Hey everyone, this is Robin with another skit tip. Today, a quick one, we're going into the creator and we're going to look at the little pop-up menus that come up. Not many people know about this one. Uh, a lot of people know about, let's see, let's get a character up here, uh, the bird. <laughs> so a lot of people know about the camera filters where you can make it nighttime and uh, inverse and black and white uh, and kind of underwater, that's my favorite. Uh, and a lot of people have seen this button over here, which lets you do the, the filters uh, or the effects on the background. So you can make it snow, you can make it rain, uh, leaves, the fall weather, uh, the, the hearts, like it's a love story, uh, and a disco kind of thing, and it's on fire, and then and sparkles too. Uh, and then it cycles back to the default, which is off. But did you know that you can tap and hold on any object in Skit, and you get some options here. One of them is the effects button. So I can take this bird, and now the bird's on fire. So not only are, is my scene maybe raining, but this bird is on fire. <laughs> and uh, the, the fire effects trail with them. Let's see what other effects we have for the bird. Um, oh, it's kind of a dance theme, so we can go, they kind of go together. So now it's kind of a, the bird can be do 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 do. He's he's doing a he's he's the dancing bird. I don't know. Let's see the next one here. Uh, oh, even better. So this one's neat because it's like this giant kind of fiesta uh, effect, and you don't even need the bird on the scene. If you move the bird up here, you're still getting all of the kind of light, fun uh, colors coming down. But it doesn't have to be about the bird. Then you can you know have have your own uh, girl in here saying, oh, it's raining Skittles. <laughs> um, let's look at another effect on the bird here. Uh, ah, jet pack. So this bird can go <laughs> Or maybe, and the jet pack has a certain, like if I move it down, it's up. If I move it up, it's down, because it tries to like follow whichever direction. So maybe the bird is injured. We can have the bird be kind of upside down. Uh, and the birds, you know, oh no, the, we have to put the bird out, and that, that, can, that can be a story. Uh, and then, anything else do we have here? Kind of the water spray? I don't know, maybe this is a, a magical bird. We'll get rid of the, the uh, nighttime for a moment, and get rid of now it's magical bird, and blue fire. You'll notice that you can't really see the blue fire very well, because um, the background's really light. Uh, effects are the, be the best when the background's a little bit darker. So if we look at this one, now you can see it because it's darker. Or even this one, now you can really see the blue frames. Now the stadium is on fire, and you can see that this bird had a lot to do with it. And if we hit the effect one more time, the effect goes off. And that's the, the default with that's off. So you can really go crazy with the effects. You can have this, um, this uh, you know, TNT can be on fire. Uh, you can have this pot of gold be, have maybe a, a sparkle effect or something. You just cycle through until you see the one that uh, you want. Sometimes the effects take a moment to appear. So uh, sometimes you need to just wait for them. Is it on fire? Yeah, all right, they, now the, 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 the pot of gold is glowing or something like that. So you can have effects on any, any item that you want, any item that drags in here, uh, and also uh, on the background itself. Mm -hmm.